Aw, don't cry, civilian. I'm here to help. Well... Well... Maybe not really. I'm actually here for personal gain. For a vendetta. For revenge. But... That automatically kind of helps you guys too, so... Yay. Um... This way? Alright. Some random dialogue, but nothing important, I guess. Background people. Speeches. Drama. What's this? A chronicle? Not really looking for those, and I know I've... Well, not picked up a lot of them. These missions, but it is what it is. Uh, I'm doing this for the story. Because I bought this game a long time ago, but never finished it. Due to, I don't know, life. This is the perfect game for, you know, a rainy afternoon. Yeah, no could smash it. Zelda style. Whoop, whoop. Some of them are easily smashed, others meh. Somebody needs my help. I hear the ha ah, ah. What's this then? Valiant hero, battle scarred veteran. Get down, yeah, I'm not afraid of you guys. You may dress like me, sort of. You are nothing like me. Nobody combat rolls like me. Woohoo! Toro, Toro. I'm so lucky. Here it comes again. It's starting to look like a Benny Hill episode. Goop. Uh, stop screaming, you loser! Save your energy for waving your sword. Finish this guy. There we go. Ow! Son of a bitch! Even more showed up. Hello. Kind of stuck in his corner, I do not like it. Finish him, please. Ah! I'm struggling with the finishing moments, because then suddenly he just backs off a little bit, or the camera turns a little and doesn't do it, but so far it's decent gameplay. I mean, I wouldn't rate this game a 10 out of 10, but it is, you know, it's fun. And it looks pretty awesome. I remember when Xbox One was announced and it played like a, a sort of tech demo thingy. And it was part of this game that they showed off. Part at the beach. You know, with everything exploding and the boats crashing and stuff like that. It was like, oh, it's freaking awesome. You gotta get me this game. And then I did buy it and then I started playing it and I was like, meh. But that wasn't fair because it is kind of fun, but I guess it was just a setting back then. I was playing with friends, we were kind of busy and... Thank you. Thank you, Centurion. No. She's thankful. Nice. But I, I didn't give it a fair shot because after that day, I was like, why didn't we play the game anymore? Oh, it must have not been good. But that was not the case. It was just like we didn't have time. Oh. No, I'm quite enjoying it. This is one of those games I guess you should just either play with like one friend and take turns or something or alone, but not with a group of friends, it's too busy. <laughs> you? I used to have a lot of friends that played games. We did tournaments like 
Tekken tournaments or or just played story modes and then everybody just took turns, stuff like that. It was really fun. They had a different job back then. A lot of people, you know, that had the same hobbies and interests as me. At my current job, eh, not so much. But it is what it is. That's why they invented online gaming, I guess. But I do miss, you know, just having some people around to play games with. It's always a lot of fun. No, oh, I don't look so sad. I have no idea where I need to go. Not here, I guess. Sometimes the game helps you out with a little marker. I need one now. Make your way to the family villa. I guess this way then. I see a marker, so... Here? They don't mind me, I'm just passing through. Going around in circles, mate. It's just... Ugh. Help me, game! Help me! Don't have a compass. Which is shitty, because I needed that. Oh wait, there's a marker over there. Game is helping me now. It's like, hurry up. <laughs> and then... This way? Hello? Enemies? I've already been here, mate. It's just... Uh, then where I need to go? Explain it to me a little better, please. Explain it to me as if I'm really stupid. Oh man, I've been stuck in games before. Just like where you had to climb a wall or a ladder or something. It wasn't really clear. You just walk by it ten times before you actually find it. And like, uh. Once I was stuck in a game, and that wasn't my fault because... Uh, you had to lower yourself to a, a lower arena. And then what was supposed to happen is a cutscene was supposed to start. And enemies were supposed to show up. But that didn't happen. So I was like, what am I doing wrong? Or where do I need to go? I was stuck for a long time before I decided to look it up on YouTube. And then I saw somebody at the same spot. And whole different shit happened. I was like, ah, oh, damn it. Oh, no. Luckily, had the option to reload an earlier checkpoint. And after that, the game worked fine. But, you know, always look on the bright side of life. Because of that, I did find a nice YouTuber. Which you do follow now, so, yay. Still going around in the same circle. Guess Marius doesn't really want revenge, he just wants to walk around. Fuck off, where do I need to go? Am I supposed to just climb up here? Something? If so, why couldn't I just done this earlier? Ah, wanted to break it. Follow the paint? Oh. A legionary murdered Atticus and Janus. Someone's in there. You two, take a look. Nothing. Get back to your post. Yes, sir. I was about to say, I hope something Save starts or triggers. And it did. Yay. We're on the right path. Oh, some green crap over here. Spears! Sweet. Nice and quiet, Marius. Good job. And we're going to find him. You murdering scum. Come on, lads. That are a lot of dudes in a small space. Ah, oh, they just <laughs> I 
couldn't even turn around. He just stabbed me in the neck. It's like, you're done. Spread out. There's a rogue soldier on the kill, and we're going to fight. Well, at least they have full health now. Yeah, fuckers. Come on, lads. Drop your weapons. Nope. Not gonna happen. Because I can't. They're like stuck to my hand. Ninja roll, ninja roll. Why don't you hit the spear in the face? It's almost point blank, and then you miss. That had really sucks ass. I was nice and dizzy. Finish him off, fuck's sake. Thank you. Good. Another one bites the dust. Now don't call your friends. You just die. Nice and peacefully. Shh, it's okay. Shh. No. Oh. Well, that was kind of anticlimactic. Up, I guess. Yep. More green stuff, new spears. No. Random big weapon. No, don't take cover. Just take it. Right in the face. You know you want to. Sexy time. Whoop. Oh. No, he survived. Good for him. Didn't last long, but still. It was recently in France. It was actually a park. It still had statues like this. It's pretty freaking awesome. You had to pay like a small fee just to walk around there, but it was freaking beautiful. I mean, I guess in Rome they would have more that look like this, but still. Friends, awesome. Back in the day I just used to go to the, you know, the big cities and stuff like that, but nowadays I tend to go to smaller villages. Just with, you know, weird, not weird, but beautiful things to see. Beautiful monuments, beautiful buildings, or have, you know, weird festivals or something like that. I like to go weird. But then again, I also like to go to theme parks, so... In, instead of just going on one long holiday, I tend to go, you know, for weekends, at two to three days, and just go lots of times each year to see as much as I can from the world. And I really enjoy it. And a lot of people need that longer holiday, and I understand why, because it's, you know, you work hard, you want some time off, but I really just like spreading it out over a long amount of time, and then, you know, work a lot of days, and then have like three or four days off, do some fun stuff, and then work again. And I really get to see beautiful places in the world. To go to Rome is on my list, definitely. Oh, I was about to say, I heard voices. Ay, 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 ay. Takes so long to mm, get out of the dance mode. If you block too soon or too late, do a little dance. Ow. Fuckers. I hate it that you guys always scream. The barbarians do it, but you guys too. It's annoying. I guess it's easy to record the dialogue. Fuck sake, die just to shut you up. I always wish he could have hit his friend, accidentally chopped his friend's head off. That would have been fun. Uh. Come on. Good. Give 
me some health back. Kinda needed that. Now can focus on this one, dude. Come on, be a good little soldier and die. Excellent. Oh, that's a nice one. Keeps him underwater. Dead. Fatality. Guess we're going up the stairs. Can we break this? I think we can. Okay. Wouldn't want that statue in my yard. It's not the first thing I want to see in the morning. What the hell kind of road are we taking to get back to the family villa? Definitely soldiers up there. Shit, played cool. Hello, played cool. Didn't get stuck on a bush. Hello, old man. Who will help Nothing to say. No All right. Water. No sanitation. No bedding. And food. What food? I have to beg for it. Are you lost, stranger? No. I'm home. Cutscene? Yes. You see, Marius, it's not always in distant lands that our greatest enemies lurk. Who are you? Why did this happen? My father was a hero of Rome. Your father was a great general and a popular senator. Too popular, perhaps. The Emperor is a jealous man. A petty man. Your father lived to serve Rome. Emperor Nero serves only himself. He seeks power for the sake of power. He believes himself a god. A cold wind from the north whispered poisonous words in the Emperor's ear. Your father and other like-minded men wanted to return Rome to its people. So the Emperor had them murdered. After all, that is what emperors do. The spoils of his greed were divided between his sons, Basilius and Commodus. He lavished upon them great powers and responsibilities for which they were unworthy. Rome is failing its children, Marius. You are a vital piece in the game of man. And you, like all of us, have a role to play. Damocles, spirit of vengeance. The fate of the Empire is in your hands. Save Rome. Save Rome from them.
I needed entry to the Emperor's tournament. This could be granted by just one man, so I paid him a visit. Damocles? I come for the tournament. Ah! <laughs> You're a gladiator. <laughs> oh. mm, the, uh, the mythical armor is it's a fine touch indeed. You gave me quite the choice. Only the most skilled fighters can enter the tournament. Let me see if you fight as well as you dress. 